Hi, Alessia here, back with another Webflow tip. So today we're going to explore how to build a marquee in Webflow. Let's jump in. So in Webflow, first thing you add a div and we can call this marquee wrapper and have it as overflow hidden. So you might or might not need this depending on how your build is set up. Then add another div and this will be your actual marquee. And let's have this to be display flex, uh, align center and justify start. Inside here, you will add your collection that we set up earlier of marquees. So you want to add an image in here. These could be logos, they could be images. So pulling from the CMS to this image, we add a class of marquee image. And we want this to have some margin to the right, let's say 20 pixels a maximum width of let's say 200 pixels and a maximum height of 200. Now for the collection list, let's have this as marquee list and we want this to be flex and you can leave it as it is or align it to the center. And finally, we want this, the collection list wrapper to be the marquee inner and we want this to not shrink or grow so let's have a fixed sizing and then making sure you duplicate this so you have two of them inside of the marquee now all that's left to do is to animate it so make sure you have the marquee inner selected go over to interactions page trigger page load start loading start animation create a new one and let's call it marquee and you want the element to move we want it to move it to the left so minus 100 percent and we want the duration to be let's say 20 seconds and we want this to trigger the class and then at the end we want to reset the marquee so move again and this time we want it to be uh, the X axis to zero and we want it to be immediate. So now save this, make sure it loops and that's it. This is your marquee. I hope that was useful. Follow for more and see you next time.